In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up Swift Lint into your Xcode project. First thing that you want to do is make sure that you have Homebrew installed. We'll be using this to install the Swift Lint package. You can take this command and paste it into your terminal and wait a couple of minutes. Next, we need to install Swift Lint using brew install Swift Lint. Now let's go to the Swift Lint repo and copy this build phase command down below. So you'll want to copy this right here and we're going to paste this inside of our Xcode project. So create a new project. Go right here to build phases and click this plus icon and select new run script phase and paste this command here. Now that you did that, you should see all the Swift Lint warnings on the warnings tab. So to correct these, we're going to first use the autocorrect command. You go into the project directory and you run Swift Lint autocorrect. And then you can open up your project again. Now we're going to correct these other rules by first creating a configuration file. So you want to create a .swiftlint.yml file inside of the root of the project. And paste the configuration default example right here. Here you'll want to select what you want to include. So under included, type in the name of your project. Now we can build and see that the rules have taken effect. So here we're going to disable the line length violation rule by putting it under disabled rules. And then we save. Now if you try to build, you'll see there's a configuration for this file. We're going to need to find this and then delete it down below. Now we're going to disable this warning for this particular line. You use a comment, swift lint, disable, and then the rule name. You can also use this for blocks of code. You don't have to do it for just lines. Just make sure after you disable it, you want to re-enable it using the enable command. That's pretty much it for rules. You should also take a look at the rule directory to know what's available for your project. That's going to do it for this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and connect with me on LinkedIn or join our Discord. All the links will be down in the description down below. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Goodbye now.